There is a lack of the way doctors are taught in medical school, that nutrition is not emphasized. It's not high tech. It's not sexy. It's not where the money's at. You know, it's not really, there's not enough doctors going into this field, but it's changing. There are many more physicians in lifestyle medicine than ever were ever before, and the, the, even the conventions are doubling in size each year, so things are changing. But, there, but let's face it, it's, there's a lack of studies using excellent nutrition or superior nutrition as a therapeutic modality. Sure, we have lots of studies on you know, eating this food and preventing cancer, mushrooms and cancer, flax seeds and cancer, this diet and heart, but there's very few studies on the right dietary protocol to reverse psoriasis, the right dietary protocol for asthmatics to get better, the right dietary protocol for people with chronic headache syndrome to recover. And I've been working with this tw in 25 years, and I'm doing research on this now, but, there, but we do need more information and more studies so, doctors, so more doctors will avail themselves of this information. Now, look, I mean, I think that, that we have enough information today, that nobody needs need weight at this point, and not take advantage of this information because thinking that there's not enough information or studies done. We can all take it, this works. I have 25 years of experience in seeing tens of thousands of people watching them get well from diseases, these diseases, and get, getting well in a predictable fashion. But that doesn't mean that it's going to permeate through society in a more profound way if we didn't have more studies and better studies done.